많은 개들이 모여 내 화를 만들어 Start off by applying an eliminating primer all over the face. Moving on to the foundation, I'm using a foundation that has a semi matte finish, and I'm just starting it using my fingers all over my face, and I'm using a blender to blend everything onto my skin. For the concealer, I'm applying it onto my dark circles and blemishes I want to cover. And then once again, I'm using the blender to blend everything. Then set everything with a matte press powder. Moving on to the contour, I'm just applying the product onto the hollows of my cheek and nose. Next, I'm using a natural muted rose color for my blush and I'm just applying it onto the apples of my cheek. To highlight the face, I'm also using a pink base highlighter that has a sheen finish and I'm just going to apply it on the highest points of my cheek, my forehead, my nose, my lips and chin. <laughs> Moving on to the brows, I'm using a brow pencil to draw them in and follow my natural arc. And I do apologize for all the stray hairs onto my brows because I am trying to grow them out. Then I'm using a spoolie brush to blend all harsh lines away. To set my brows in place, I'm just going to apply a brow gel mascara. Moving on to the eyes, start off by applying an eye primer and set it with a translucent powder. Then apply a matte dusty coral shadow all over the crease. Next, apply a matte warm rose shadow onto the crease using a detailed brush to make the eyes more defined. Then go back to the first eyeshadow used to feather out any harsh lines. I'm also going to apply a matte smoky violet eyeshadow onto the outer V of my eyes and blending it towards the middle of my lids. <laughs> Moving on, I'm using a concealer and an angled brush to semi-cut my crease. Then setting it again with a translucent powder. Then I'm applying a metallic rusty orange shadow on my lid and leaving the top bit plain. <laughs> then 
then layer a metallic mid-tone pink plum shadow on top of the other metallic shadow then use what's left on the brush and apply it to the lower lash line as well to highlight the inner corners Use a satin light peachy pink eyeshadow onto the inner lid. Next, use a burgundy liquid eyeliner to line the eyes and winging out in the end. For the eyelashes, curl your top and bottom eyelashes first. Then apply a burgundy mascara to create a hazy effect looking lashes. I'm also applying a lengthening false lashes and then coating it with the same burgundy mascara. Moving on to the lips, line your lips with a warm strawberry colored liner. And then apply the same color using a liquid lipstick. And you're done! <laughs> 